We all know the story of Clifford. You might have even heard of the Easter story. But I bet you've never heard the story of the mobile book van. Lots of kids engrossed in books. Tale as old as time, right? Well, let's back up a bit to the beginning of how we even got here. Sort of a labor of love, I guess? A passion project, you could say. And this story started a few years ago after this compassionate teacher won a $3,000 award. So I took about $1,000 of that $3,000 and bought probably 350 close to $400, 400 books. She took those books and did something for others, for kids. Those books each filled the hands of the little ones who were eager to learn. A lot of people ask me why I do it. <laughs> um, I have three kids. I have a full-time job. I'm also getting my master's. Um, but when I see students and when I see children excited about reading, there's just nothing, there's nothing better. The books are packed in the back of her van and unloaded at multiple stops every week. Oh, these may be a little heavy. Why don't you try? For Jory, there's nothing better than this. Hi. Are you here for the bookmobile? Yeah, we've never been. Awesome! What? Pages and pages absorbed by these young minds. I like a lot of books. I like reading and I'm getting books. Pat, you're, you're not no, forgetting good. anything. What about the tent? They say the best things in life are free. Ah, uh, Clifford's a good one. Winnie the Pooh and Tigger too, he'd like that one too. We already have this. I'm the princess and the popper. While this started off her own dime, she now relies on donations, which she says is easier than you might think. The Baraboo community is incredibly generous. And when I ask for books, people bring them. So many books. It's hard to keep track, but just how many? Ooh, <laughs> that's a really great question. Thousands of books. Thousands. Do you know how many minds will expand, how many pages flipped, how many minds at work, and how many kids with a new free book in their hands? My goal is to get try to find every kid a book, and I think we were able to do that today, right? Yeah. Awesome. High five. In Baraboo, Jamie Perez, WISC News 3.